Well, good day, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. So today's video is going to be a real short one. We're going to talk about the difference between half space machines and full space machines. What the heck is that all about? Well, when you type a character or hit the space bar on a typewriter, the machine is designed to function one of two ways. You could have it like with the Smith Corona Silent Super on your left here, is when you press the space bar down or a key, the carriage moves one whole space, and when you release the space bar or the key, that's it. Nothing else happens. It's already done the full space. But on the case of the Olivetti Underwood Studio 45, if you press the space bar or a key down, the carriage moves a half space, and when you release it, it moves the other half space. So two different ways that the escapements will move the carriage. What's the difference? And functionally speaking, as far as just basic writing, there's no real difference, except in the case of a half-space machine, if you have forgotten a letter in an already typed word, you can go back, erase that word, and insert the missing letter by borrowing a half-space from before and after the word using the half-spacing feature on the half-space typewriter. This Olivetti is not only a half-line machine in terms of each click of the ratchet is half a line, but it's a half-space machine, meaning when you press the space bar down, the carriage moves a half-space, and when you release it, it moves the other half-space. Well, this is how you can insert missing characters from an already typed word or line. So let's assume this sentence is the word, 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 right? Just three words, except the middle one, which I've typed in red, is WRD, it's missing the O. And so the way you would type this, would correct it, you would first erase the middle word, the, the errant word. I'm just gonna retype it. So we'll just pretend like this is my line and I've erased that word. When you want to put your print position now lined up with the last letter of the previous word, and then you press and release the space bar, and then you press and hold the space bar and type your first letter, and then you release the space bar, press and hold it, type your second letter, do the same with the third and the fourth. And there you can see that I've actually inserted an extra letter in the place of half a space on either side of that word. So I basically borrowed a half a space from the beginning and ending of the word to make enough room for that extra letter. And you can do that with a half space machine. Now half spacing typewriters will also give you the ability to uh, do things like if you want to do superscripts or subscripts above and below the line, you can make those characters a little closer to the primary character. Or even in the case of using a contraction when you're using an apostrophe, you can type the word without the apostrophe and then go back and insert the apostrophe halfway between the two characters and it makes the word look a little bit more compact. Here you can see on top the example of the Smith Corona Silent Super which is a full space machine. I've used uh, the word isn't, which has a contraction. The apostrophe is fully spaced between the N and the T. And down below, you can see the Olivetti Underwood Studio 45 is a half space machine. I have my choice of either doing the standard full spacing of the apostrophe and the contraction, or as you can see to the right, I've chosen to put the apostrophe halfway between the N and the T using the half space feature. So you have more options with a half space machine in terms of the typography of how apostrophes work in contractions. This is especially useful if you have a script typewriter. The apostrophe looks a lot more normal because with the script typeface, the characters have connectors. And if you break up that connection with a full space apostrophe and a contraction, it looks kind of disjointed. But if you type the whole word without the apostrophe, all the letters are joined because of the script typeface. And then you can put the apostrophe in halfway over between the other two, between the two characters. So half space machine does give you that ability and it is kind of a nice feature. So that might be one of the attributes of a typewriter that might be important to you when you're out shopping for a typewriter. Is it a half space or is it a full space typewriter? That might be important to you. Well, this is Joe, a short little video today. I wish you well, stay creative, have yourselves a great day. Bye-bye.